So tonight, before we go, I want to pay tribute to our former boss and founder, Roger Ailes, who passed away this morning at the age of 77. He created a giant of a news organization out of nothing. He had a clear vision for Fox News, and he cheered us on to hit it out of the park year after year against our competition. When it came to the big nights, debates, conventions, elections, he would tell those of us going on the air that it was more important to be right than first, and that if we were ever wrong, to get right out there and correct it, and he'd have our back. He reminded us to look like we were having fun out there, and we were, and we will, and we thank him for that. So one quote is not enough, so I have three tonight. Roger said, television and I grew up together, and they did, and he loved television. From his days as producer of The Mike Douglas Show, where he found a young comedian named George Carlin and met a politician named Richard Nixon. He went on to coordinate the coverage of the moon landing from the Oval Office. He also said growing up in Ohio and just being kind of an average guy from flyover country, my dad was a factory guy, I tried to put those things on screen that reflect reality. I don't mind if people want to argue with that or if they think that's crazy. And finally this, everybody fears the unknown but I have a strong feeling there's something bigger than us. I don't think this all exists because some rocks happen to collide. I'm at peace. When it comes, I'll be fine, calm. I'll miss life though, especially my family. And our thoughts tonight are with his wife, Beth, and his son, Zach. Good night, Roger.